G'day, today I'm cooking roast pork, a recipe my brother from Hobart gave me. He cooks it on the barbecue down there. I'm gonna do the same here on the Ziegler Brown. Firstly, we need to score the pork. With your knife, go down through the rind and the fat of the pork, almost to the meat, cutting nice fine lines right through, right round the pork. This way you get really good crackling. You can use a box cutter or a Stanley knife to do this. Once you've gone through it, go back through it again and make sure that you've cut nice even lines through the pork. Once you finish your cutting, you need to add salt all over the pork, lots and lots of salt, making sure it goes down deep into the cracks, smothering it, and then rubbing it in nice and deeply. Grab yourself a baking tray, fill it with a centimetre deep of water, then get a rack and place that on top of your baking tray, then place your pork. Fire up the barbecue. While the pork is resting, you want to get your barbecue up to around 240, 250 degrees. Once it's there, you need to place your pork in the centre of the barbecue and close the lid. Turn your burners down after about 20 minutes and try and maintain a temperature between 190 and 200, adjusting as you need. I turn my pork halfway through the cooking process. It's about half an hour for every 500 grams. You can use a meat thermometer to see when your pork is cooked, but in this case, I think it's pretty ready. There you have it. Roast pork on the Ziegler Brown barbecue with the perfect crackling. Listen to that snap. Perfect crackling. All you need now is to carve it up and serve it with roast veggies and gravy or some nice roast pork rolls with gravy. Enjoy.